Rome is lonely on a Sunday. Hello again. It's Vespucci sitting in Rome at a very nice pizzeria eating lunch. So a bunch of problems occurred during the last couple of days. The worst thing that happened or that's going to happen is that Kathy is going to catch her flight tonight back to Berlin. And then I'll be on my own for a month. Next thing that happened is that I lost my camera. I was so sure that before we went to the beach or while we're at the beach I knew where it was and when we came back to that nice camping spot in Sardinia the next morning it was gone. I don't know where it went but it was gone. <laughs> so this is what happened. Mm. Today in Rome I bought a new one Yes, but it's a good camera and I'm quite happy with it, so what you gonna do? Um, Kathy is having troubles with her, um, with her check-in of her flight. Um, EasyJet has the wrong name, it shouldn't be called EasyJet, it should be called Complicated Jet or Trouble Jet. At the airport we're gonna have to check her in. Once she's checked in, we go to the beach for a couple of hours and then that'll be it. I'm gonna drive through Rome tomorrow and show you all the nice stuff, Colosseum and everything. Gonna do that tomorrow. For today, we have so much shit on our plate that we're gonna do it this way around. So, you're looking through the lens of a n brand new DJI I want to save you all the um, tragic goodbye shots from the airport tonight, so I'm going to cut that out. So say goodbye to Kathy, she'll be leaving, eating, enjoying and smiling as always. I love that. I'm going to miss that so much. <laughs> So that's that. A lot of people shopping, a lot of people trying to sell you stuff in Rome, in everywhere. Okay, bye bye. Bye bye, Kathy. <laughs> and a very good day to you guys. I hope everything is working. Camera is recording, recording like it should. You see, there's a couple of differences here. Um, the front is green now. There is no Kathy and no Mitzi Klein. Mitzi Klein is in the back here. I put her here to make sure that she's fine. But let's see how traveling all by myself is gonna turn out. Well, I'm gonna take you to Rome now. We're gonna have, uh, we're gonna pass the Vatican City. We're gonna pass the Pantheon and the Colosseo. I wanna show you that. Mm, then I'm gonna take the Mautstraße, so the pay road. I'm gonna take that down to Napoli to Vesuvio. There is kind of a hippie campground at Vesuvio and this is where we're going tonight. Ciao Danilo. And yeah, this is how it's gonna turn out. So let's do some sightseeing. Some Vespa sightseeing of Rome, the eternal city. We've been there last night. You have heard all the problems that occurred in the last night. You also know that I'm recording off of a brand new DJI. 
today is a very special day. I wanted to uh, bring out a parcel. I wanted to, to send the helmet of Kathy and a couple of things she couldn't take with her. I wanted to send that. But today is Assumption Day or Ferragosto or Maria Himmelfart. Fart. Maria is not farting in heaven. It's Maria Himmelfart, so Maria going to heaven. Assumption Day. Very important holiday in Italy. This is why a lot of stuff is closed, so I haven't um, taken the hassle of trying to send out a parcel. Subura, Gangs of Rome is what I'm thinking of when driving through that tunnel. So I have seen some shitty roads in my life, but this Rome here that tops everything. You see that hole? If I drive through there, I'm fucked. Yeah, I stated it on Instagram already, but I have rode on gravel roads in Germany that were paved better than these roads here. That's insane, man. I am not so sure, but this is very well maybe the outer walls of the Vatican already. Or is it the Roman city wall? I think it's the Vatican. And is this? This is it. When I was a kid, we entered right here at the Museo Vaticano. See, and everything is closed today because it's a it's a holiday. Yep. Are actually made our first spot and I gotta stop saying actually god damn it oh I just said god damn it in front of the Vatican I am so sorry Porta Angelica this is where I wanted us to bring or this is where I set the marker so welcome to the Vatican we also seen some of the Swiss guards there the Swiss guards of Vaticano Going to the Pantheon. Sweet, right? Very cool. Okay, let's keep moving. I don't know if I am on a pedestrian street right here, but I don't know. We will see. I think I'm gonna go right, right here. That's probably the fruiting, as we would say.
It's a lot of fun riding through the Eternal City. Yesterday this German fella I talked to, he said like, oh you're going to Rome, the city of scooters. And um, I said, if you think Rome is the city of scooters, you haven't been to Genoa. <laughs> taken here. That is cool. I'm going to make a spot. Hi there. This road looks nice. Carabinieri won't let me through here. Well, here we go. Okay, so the Carabinieri didn't want me to go through there. I understand. So. I'm not sure if I'm in the pedestrians area here. I mean, there's all the cars standing here. Oh, and here we go with the Pantheon. Zentrale. It's nice, isn't it? Follow the route for a kilometer. Let's see if that works out. Because usually when she's saying something like that, it never works. See if it didn't work. I don't know what kind of route she wanted me to follow, but it's but it was not the one. What is Merulana? Merulana! Woohoo! We did it! Brancaggio, wasn't I already on Brancaggio? This seems oddly familiar. I rode down here yesterday already, I'm pretty sure. This all seems oddly familiar. Yeah, and there we go, guys. Yes! Woohoo! That is the one. The Colosseum. You might seen it already on Instagram. But here we go by video. Because actually my Vespa and the Colosseum have never been on live television before. <laughs> Together. Okay, I'm gonna... Am I, am I gonna stop here? No. No, we've seen it. We're fine. This is not a, this is not a pedestrian road. You little dipshits. <laughs> wow. I'm gonna make a halt here. Show you this nice area here. That looks cool, right? 
Oh, a woman that is posing like that up there can only be Russian. I bet you she's Russian. Привет! She was so Russian. It's ridiculous how those Russians always pose. Really ridiculous. Okay, I show you that view. That view is nice. Right? And here we go with the nice Roman roads again. Yeah, I wrote those yesterday. They are horrible. Horrible. Egyptian obelisk here. Wonderful. show you this we are leaving Rome or at least the ancient outer rim of Rome right now it looks like there is a fire welcome to volcano country That was a bush fire. This guy up front there has a broken catalyzator. Catalyzator, catalyzator. And this thing stinks way more than the bush fire back there. So I can't uh, point the finger on it or be absolutely sure. But this sure looks like a big volcano over there. So chances are that this is Vesuvio. Um, welcome to Napoli. I'm gonna pay my mouth fees now. Let's see how much it is. Receipt. Emission. Not yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Seventeen twenty was a ride of about two hundred kilometers. See, I started. I started at Roma Est. Arrivederci. Arrivederci, I'm gonna try to do some nice drone shots of that today. So I hope I can somehow get up there and film like the Schlot, but I can't promise you. I am driving for another 4.7 kilometer. These are huge stones. Terzino. I am in Terzino. Hola, uh, buongiorno, ciao, 
at Vesuvio Eco Camping. Vesuvio is right there. I have the pleasure to camp right here. And well, I love those chill hippie spots. They always make up for the easy going, for the most easy going camping. The Vesuv is right behind me, right back there. You can't see it at the moment, but if everything goes as planned, and you know it never does with me, <laughs> but if it goes as planned, then I'm gonna get some nice Vesuv drone shots. Coming up, right? No!